Want to speak real Turkish from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at turkishclass101.com. Merhaba, ben Seda. Hoş geldiniz. Hello, my name is Seda and welcome. What are we doing and where is this place? This is turkishclass101.com and we talk about Turkish and Turkey a lot. So, today we'll be, we will be talking about the month of February in Turkey. This is the shortest month ever and it will be the shortest video ever because nothing is going on during February in Turkey and let's roll, okay? First of all, let's learn the word February. It is Şubat. 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 Şubat en kısa aydır. Şubat en kısa aydır. Şubat en kısa aydır. February is the shortest month. Şubat as a month uh, also known as küçük ay, small month, or cüce ay, dwarf month. And what is special about this month? <laughs> My birthday! Yeah, I was born in February and that's it. That's not for a month and we are done with this video. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm not just kidding, but there's not much going on. Anyway, I talk about the winter break in January video and generally the first week of February is still the winter break for K-12 to schools and also universities generally take their winter break during February but every university can be different so check it out and since it is still off time for a lot of students the winter holiday spots are generally very crowded and so consider this if you are planning to visit Turkey and you can check out our December and January videos for different vacation winter vacation spots I talked about them a lot in those videos so what else we have we celebrate Valentine's Day and we call it 14 Şubat Sevgililer Günü 14 Şubat Sevgililer Günü Bu sene 14 Şubat Sevgililer Günü'nde bir programın var mı? Bu sene 14 Şubat Sevgililer Günü'nde bir programın var mı? Do you have any plans for Valentine's Day? Hayır maalesef yok çünkü bir sevgilim yok. Hayır maalesef yok çünkü bir sevgilim yok. Now, unfortunately, I don't have any plans because I don't have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. Sevgili, as a word, is a gender neutral word, can be both for woman and man. And Sevgililer Günü is relatively new for Turkey. It's been celebrated, you know, widely for the last decade or two. And it's more of an advertising thing, but generally it's celebrated, especially among young couples. We do not have tradition to, you know, give Valentine's Day cards to each other like in Hollywood movies in kindergarten and so. Only couples do couples think like give each other presents, go out for dinner or movies or something like that. And a lot of companies offer special prices for Sevgililer Günü. And if you go out like shopping malls, you will probably like notice with a lot of red store with like designs, hearts, teddy bears and red 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 everywhere uh you know referring to valentine's day theme and that's it there is seriously nothing else going on <laughs> as i explained before though sometimes we do have religious holidays or we can have ramadan before the holiday and it changes every year due to different calendars we use for daily and religious life and so if you want to make sure that if we have any religious holidays, check it out before your visit. And now let's look at the weather. How is the weather in Shubat in Turkey? It is cold, generally cold and sometimes snowy. But let's look at the regions, like one region at a time, okay? Let's look. Marmara region. Average temperature is 6.1 one 
uh, and it was like 7.2 in in 2022 the lowest was minus 5.6 in Balakese and highest was 21.1 in Ghana. Asian region. The long-term average temperature is 7.4. It was 7.9 in 2022. The lowest was 9, uh, minus 9.7 in Afyon Karagisar and the highest temperature was 20.6 in Milas. Mediterranean region. The average temperature is 8.6. It was 9.6 in 2022. The lowest was minus 13.1 in Göksun and the highest was 23.9 in Iskander. Central Anatolia region. The long-term average is 0.9. It was 1.5 in 2022. The lowest was minus 19.3 in Gemerek. The highest was 17.3 in Kayseri. Black Sea region, the average is 4. It was 5.5 in 2022. The lowest was minus 13.5 in Bolu. The highest was 24.4 in Hoka. Eastern Anatolia region, uh, the long-term average temperature is minus 2.8. It was minus 0.5 in 2022 and the lowest was minus 26.7 in Azal. The highest was 17.1 in Ergani. And the last one, Southeastern Anatolia region, the long-term average is 6.1. It was 8.8 .8 in 2022. The lowest was minus 5.7 in Batman and the highest was 24.5 in Gizre. Welcome back. Okay, you can see the difference between the highest and the lowest is really large. It changes and the average is getting higher and higher and higher due to the global warming every year and if you are going to visit here and you want the detailed information i will put some link here to see the you know government meteorology site here it's like mgm.go.tr mgm is not the movie company it's meteorology site okay this was the weather and this was all i can say about this one it's like a winter time and it's like cozy homey time nothing to do outside a lot and you know have you guys ever 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 visited turkey during shubat and how did you find it where did you go how was the weather i don't like going out a lot during this month it's my cozy homey time and how is it for you and if you like this video i hope you did you can check our other videos and you can check Turkish Class 101.com like more videos like this and we have a lot of documents like PDFs, listening, video, audio, writing, a lot of uh, Turkish, you know, study thing you can find and I will see you next time. Görüşmek üzere. Kendinize çok iyi bakın. Hoşçakalın. Want to speed up your language learning? Take your very first lesson with us. You'll start speaking in minutes and master real conversations. Sign up for your free lifetime account. Just click the link in the description.